month-long year hiatus, the highly anticipated Real Husbands of Hollywood is back with a new limited series, Real Husbands of Hollywood, More Kevin, More Problems. We'll uh -oh. be streaming on BET Plus <laughs> February 10th. And today we're joined by the lovely leading ladies of the show, here to dish all about what we can expect. Please welcome Michelle Weaver, Angela Rye, and Cynthia K. McWilliams. Hey, ladies. Hey, ladies. Hello. Hey. Oh. Cynthia, you know what? You're a part of the original cast that we loved. What was it like being back on set with everyone? Oh, girlfriend, it was such a surprise to be back. For years, people kept trailing me on the streets talking about, hey, Trina! <laughs> As you know, everybody on the show called me Trina Shaw for the longest time. Right. Because I was the only character on the show, you know, that didn't play herself. So everybody <laughs> thought I was actually Trina Shaw and actually Kevin Hart's lawyer. They'd be tracking me on the street. <laughs> Trina, girl, Trina, when is the show coming back? And for like two years, I was like, y'all, we not coming back. Babies, let it go. But here we are five years later, now who look like boo-boo the fool? Me. So it was See? Crazy. Never know. <laughs> Never that know. is hysterical. Now, Angela, you're one of many important voices in black culture. We appreciate you so much. But we love to see you popping up in our favorite shows like this one. So tell us about your role on this series. Yeah, so I am Nelly's fiance on this series. Nice. And I think it's a surprise. Ooh. All of us, <laughs> uh, but it was fun. And I think one of the greatest things about Real Husbands of Hollywood is it is not a part of the Real Housewives franchise. And it is something where it's really a spoof on reality TV. We know that reality TV is supposed to be unscripted, but sometimes it feels a little scripted. And um, this show is definitely scripted and it was a lot of fun. Um, thanks to folks like Michelle and Cynthia who welcomed me with open arms. It was such a good time. And so I, I just look forward to doing something with all of them in the future. It was a great show. Well, I'm excited for this, but Michelle, I loved you in the series, Love Is, and now you're starring opposite Kevin Hart as his wife. What was it like working with that crazy? <laughs> you know, it was awesome working with Kevin. It really was. Just everybody, the showrunners, the producers, the cast, the other, um, the, even the crew, everybody was, it was a really fun time. And I feel like Kevin, um, there's three different Kevins. There's the business Kevin, the talent Kevin, and then the personality Kevin. Nice. Yes. So the business Kevin was like so inspiring. He goes hard, mm. always working. And so it was great to watch that and to learn from it. The talent Kevin, he is such a good partner in a scene. He really wants his partners to shine just like him, which is sometimes hard to find in Hollywood, unfortunately, but he really is an awesome person to play with, play against. And so the person, Kevin, is a hoot. So I was a little nervous coming onto the set because everybody knows each other. Everyone's been working with each other for so long. They're friends. Um, but then once Kevin started making fun of me, I was like, okay, we good. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. family. <laughs> yeah, you family. <laughs> right. <laughs> I love it. Now, the celebrity guest featured on the show, do not disappoint. Cynthia, who was one of your faves? Oh, now, come on. You know who my favorite is. It's these two ladies sitting right in front of me. I love it. Oh, that's awesome. I love it. It's Angela Rye and Michelle Weaver. That's who I'm happy. You know who else, it. though, honestly? I have heard that Nene Leakes was guest starring this week hosting with you guys, yes, right? Yes, this is the yes. You know, she did an episode with us. She was on, I think, back in season four or five. Uh -huh. uh, but she was fantastic. She came in and killed the set. She was, like how Michelle said, the guys will, you know, give you a hard time and make fun of you. Oh, she was not having it. She came out the <laughs> gate snapping on people. <laughs> so she threw the game and she played it. So yeah, Nene was a plus. That was a good one too, one yeah, of my faves. Awesome. Love to hear that. Michelle, we know that you're happily married in real life, but are you anything like the character when it comes to your own relationship? Uh, well, I think no two marriages are alike. Like, let's just be honest, right? Everyone is so unique. Um, but I, originally I felt like I was like Akira in the sense of, you know, being patient, letting, uh, she really lets Kevin be himself. And so, but I think I realized that I'm more like Kevin. I'm like more sporadic and, and an artsy person, always doing something, starting projects, not finishing them, but... Kevin actually finishes them, but, <laughs> and Akira is his anchor. And so my partner is very much my anchor. Aww. And so that's how we are alike, which that's is so awesome. Great. And then also 
the the funny thing is though my husband does have a sense of humor <laughs> like Kevin always just playing jokes witty comeback one-liners for everything so that's really fun I'm not, you know awesome. I can practice my comedy at the house which is awesome <laughs> that is awesome Angela you said you're playing Nelly's love interest and from the looks of it it looked like somebody getting married. Spill the tea. Yes, ah! what is going on here? <laughs> well, I do not want to give any spoilers, but you should watch. There, a wedding occurs, but we it should does? just, you know, see what ooh, happens ooh, at the I wedding. I cannot wait. <laughs> a wedding occurs. See, I've already said too much. I knew that was going to happen. I was yes. like, don't have me spoiling stuff. Turn, tune in February 10th to <laughs> BT Plus to get the rest. So I don't get, I just was, you know, giving kudos and spreading love to Michelle and to Cynthia. Now they're going to be ready to fight me. They'd be like, really, you going to tell it all on the real? <laughs> you know what, though, Angela? What was the highlight of your experience on this show? You know, I really think um, there's this moment that was not on camera, but we basically formed a union and Cynthia was our president. And I <laughs> yes. think that um, that was my favorite moment. Like, really, truly, when we talk about Black Girl Magic, we often underestimate how critical the role is that your sister friends play. Mm. And so to be on set, Michelle, I didn't know that this was your first time interacting with these folks. You seem like a natural part of this family. So I was like, I'm the new kid on the block. You and you, cause you were such a natural, you know, that was the energy you gave and you all, I felt like welcomed me in. So that to me is like, this is a sisterhood that will last far beyond any season of this show. And I think that was the highlight for me. Oh, so sweet. Okay, Aww. Cynthia, so what can the fans expect from this new iteration of the show? Oh, well, it's a new season, but it is going to be the same old Tom Foolery. So <laughs> what fans can expect? <laughs> It is a lot of the same ignorance that they came uh, to, to, to be fans of in season one through five. Um, we do have a ton of fantastic uh, guest stars as well coming on this season in addition to these lovely ladies. Um, I also am really excited because this season we had two new female writers in the writer room and just in the oh, spirit of all that so love of women. Yes. Say, so yes, important. So important. Having two new women in the writer's room, mm -hmm. Amber Maria Allen and Robin Henry, that was amazing. And I think that that's going to also add to the fact that this season we do see some new female driven storylines that balance out a lot of that male energy on the show. Cause mm. you know these men, yes. ooh lord. Ooh, yes. speaking of ooh lord, we got a clip <laughs> from Real Husbands of Hollywood and more Kevin and more problems. Let's check it out. The Real Husbands of Hollywood is back. Only this time we're on BET Plus. So we got plus up action. Slamming Plus up guest stars. I didn't know Mike Tyson dad was an astronaut. Bigger reveals. Oh, wow. <laughs> and I got myself a plussed up new wife. Thank you for my Lambo truck. Woo. All this plussing has got me thirsty. Hey, can somebody give me a plus size soda over here, please? <laughs> Michelle, Angela, and Cynthia, thank you so much for hanging out with us today. Make sure you all check out the new Real Husbands of Hollywood. More Kevin, more problems, February the 10th, only on BET+. Plus, you can head on over to thereal.com for more information on how to start your BET+, seven-day free trial today.